What's going on guys? SG Cube is here. Welcome back to you and BAM 100% best tutorial part 2 ha 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 lol Where's my pen? Hold on. I need to edit this paper. I don't have a I don't have a pen whatever. Okay. It's just imagine this is sarcasm, all right? But anyways, back to the video. So, get my cube. Get out of here. Alright. So, we did a oh, camera. Did. Okay. Put this photo apart. There we go. So that we can see. Okay. Set the camera back. We got. It. So, we left off on the part one of the tutorial with making the white cross. So, we just scramble this. Really quickly, you can see that what we really. so let's just do a quick recap. So the really first step of make of solving the tree by tree is to make a white cross. So to make a white cross, we do a daisy, which the daisy should look something like this. If you haven't watched the video, I highly recommend you watch that one before you watch this one. It's a lot better. All right, but anyways, after you made the daisy, just screw it right like that. Match the color, match the center cap, boom, boom, matched it, bam, and then bam, put it down, then this one, match it, and then do R2, put it down, do this, do that, R2, put it down, and there's the white cross completed. So what we're going to talk about today in part 2 is the white corners. Now, the white, the corners, the first few corners that you're gonna do, the four, the four, the first four corners that you're gonna do, is not too difficult. Um, it's it's medio mediocre because that's one of the easiest parts that you know, like if people sometimes people ask, how do you solve tree by tree, and if I'm patient enough to teach them, you know, I taught them the cross to go out, but then after the the corners pretty easy to learn because it's just one algorithm so if you if you don't know what's an algorithm algorithms are a set of moves you perform to do something on the cube like if you have a case that you need to solve the cube you just do an algorithm and that's basically it also I have I have, I have a live commentary forgot to say that but anyways uh talking off topic here Let's go back to what we're here today, why we're here today actually, and do the white corners. Now, what we're gonna learn today is how to properly look, uh, how to properly, what was it, how to, how to, how to properly speak English. No, I'm just kidding. We're gonna, uh, learn how to properly, what's that one? I thought, th okay, hold on, I, I need a break just to think of the word. I couldn't think of a word, but just to say it in very bad English, how to properly put the corners at the right place. So, yeah, I'm bad at English. So yeah, so the so the main focus, of course, is to do the white corners. And before we do that, I'm going to teach you one algorithm. So that algorithm is. The, I call it the righty elk or the sexy move if you want to be the real word the righty elk just sounds I don't know better because you do it on your right all the times so I'm just gonna say righty elk every single time I say righty elk I'm talking about that elk so the righty elk is R U R prime U prime now if you don't know what I just said that means you didn't watch the last video now go back to the last video, you can see that I talked about notations, I talked about R, I talked about R prime, talked about L, talked about L prime. I just talked about all the notations. So you should know what notations are by now, so if you watch that video. So that's the algorithm, the righty out, R, U, R prime, U prime, that's all. So to that, that's the one algorithm that you need to learn uh, to be able to insert the white corners into the place now uh so oh, sorry i blocked the camera 
adjust this so that it's not bad. All right. So um, to actually insert the corners into the right place, you know, so you don't do it wrongly. Here is a few tricks. First off, uh, you want to find a corner you want to. So example, the blue and orange one. So I find you want to find the two colors. That's not white, you know, obviously. So blue and orange. So blue and orange. So now what you want to do is take the corner and put it in between those two pieces, as you can see. So this white piece is in between these two pieces, right? The two, so orange and blue. So they're in between orange and blue. So after that, and I just got a notification. Oh, got to. Yep, this happened in the last video as well. Why does this keep happening? Okay, there we go. See, no more notifications. See? Perfect, alright. Sorry, sorry, apologies. I'm just saying sorry so I have to edit it in a video. Because editing takes so long. Okay, but anyways, righty out. So, after you find the correct uh, position. Oh, that's the word position. Um, after you found the right position. Yes. You just do the righty out until this white faces down. Now, you want to make sure you focus on where the right is. So, the righty out is... Put it on, I'll put it on top of the screen here, you should see it. We should see it like right over here. So, R, U, R prime, U prime. Is it down yet? Nope. R, U, R prime, U prime. It's not even there, it's here. R, U, R prime, U prime. Now as you can see, the white corner has been placed correctly. It's connected to these pieces, see? Orange, orange, blue, blue. And it's facing down with white. So that is how you insert the corners. Now you just want to do the same for every piece. So the this is the red and green. You want to find the red and green center. Right here. And put it, remember, put it in between. You have to make sure it's in between. And then just do the right yelk. R, U, R prime, U prime. Alright, now I got lucky. So I, the edge piece. So but, but normally you would have to do R, U, R prime, U prime. And just keep doing that until the corner goes in. So that's basically it. Now, people usually don't remember the algorithm, so that's one of the most hardest part. Just you got, just have to remember. If you can't, if you can't remember R U R prime U prime, you can also remember up, left, down, right, up, left, down, right, up, left, down, right. Not is not as in the but in the direction the cube is moving. See, it's moving upwards, but I don't, I don't like that. So just remember R, U, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime. Now you want to make sure that the corner you insert is actually the correct one. As you can see here, while you're doing your R, R prime, U, uh, R, U, R prime, U prime, there could be another corner that inserts and you might just think, oh, it's white, so it's correct. But you see that the two colors are not the same. See, green and blue, that's not the same. Orange and red, they're not the same. So you want to make sure that you actually get the right corner piece in. As you can see, blue, blue, red, red. Now just keep doing that. Right here. Find uh, find the orange and green and put them in between. So in between. Then do the righty out. R, U, R prime, U prime. R, U, R prime, U prime. R, U, R R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime. Corners done. Woohoo. That, alright, so that was basically, that's actually all of everything that I wanted to tell you today. We're gonna, so, let's just, let's just recap on everything and make sure you remember the righty out, which is very important. Alright, uh, you wanna write it down. Or something you can I'll put it on the top of the screen so you know make sure you remember it it's very important so first step we do the daisy here we go we have the daisy now also uh, when I teach my friends to do like example the daisy uh, things like this see there's there's like there's I think that yeah there's three I think two only two types of things you're doing the daisy. First one is where the the edge piece is either already up here or it's facing down or it's facing here. Like this. But uh, when it's facing down or any to the side 
and upwards already. It's pretty easy because if it's facing down, all you need to do is rotate it twice, 180 degrees, and you can see that it comes up. But if it's like this, it's facing up. No matter how you rotate it, the front it's not gonna face upwards like this one. So to solve this, all you need to do is rotate the front one time, and as you can see, it's like it's facing. You it should be facing like it should be facing the side now. If you know if you're holding like this, but if you're yeah, just like this, it should just now the white should be facing you. But instead, now it's in this position, you move this out the way. You can actually just use a, a rotation on R, and you can see that it goes up. Same thing with this red here. Just do one rotation from the front, and then move it upwards. See? So where's the last piece here? But this one is already on the side, so you can do that. And boom. So now you match the center colors. Now this is red and red. See? Red, red. So the white... So it should be white, whatever color, whatever color, same. So white, red, red. So white, same, same. So white, red, red, those are same. Then just do R2, move it 180 degrees all the way down. Now orange. So that, there we go. White, same, same. Right, orange, orange. Now move is correct. So move it all the way down. Now we have to find the blue one. Here we go. White, same, same. White, blue, blue. Correct. Move it the way down. And then green. White god that was another notification dang it okay this time okay you remember to do it so white same thing so white green green and then put it down there we go then the corners to you have to find the colors and put it in between so this is green and orange put it in between green and orange and do the righty elk remember the righty elk right here remember it r u r prime u prime r u R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime. As you can see, it goes down. So you just have to keep doing it until you see it go down. Next, so next one, uh, red and green. Put it in between red and green center. R, U, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime, U prime. As you can see, it's the corner done. Now for this one, orange and blue. And now if you see a piece that is stuck in the bottom here, that is not up here. All you need to do is do the righty elk to take it out. See, if if you have this here, this white piece, as you can see, it's not correct. It's supposed to be here because blue and red, blue and red. All you need to do is do the righty elk. R U R prime U prime. Now it's on top, so blue and orange. Now you can just put it in between blue and orange and do R U R prime U prime. Oh, and it goes in. So just keep doing it. Now this is uh blue and orange. Uh, blue. Th this is blue and red. This is blue and orange. Sorry. So then do R U R prime U prime the righty L R U R prime U prime 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 in the corner and your white should be soft. So that's basically it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Next video we're gonna talk about the second layer here. First we I call this first layer, second layer, third layer. So we're gonna talk about the edges, the edges tomorrow, and it should look a bit something like this after we're done with the. After we're done with the corners, it should look something like this, right? It's just... Corners, oh no, no deflation, sorry. Boom. Edge is inserted, and all the edge, second layer, should be soft as well, which leaves only the last layer. So that should be it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe, like if you did, subscribe if you're new, comment what you think, and and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Oh my gosh, okay. Bye!